Hello. Good evening. Let's get back into the old scrolls. Task off. I've got no time for beggars or dishonest traders, and I'm in the mood to throw someone into the river. Oh, really? I was certain the old bastard had forgotten his battle companions. In our day, we cut a bloody path across elsewhere in High Rock. But why but a letter for me? My companion should be along at any moment. Wait until he finds out Bosley. Well, I'll be a harpy's uncle. I never expected to see you here. Are you a cypher? Well, I don't know. Let me see that. Interesting. So Bosrog wants to give Kurog a traditional Orsamer Requiem, does he? I heard that the king was dead. I guess this confirms it. But I'll be a harpy's hairdresser if I can figure out how you're involved in all this. I suppose the job of King Slayer pays well. You could have sent word. Me and my crew haven't exactly been turning away offers with a stick, you know. You couldn't take a moment to send a message to old friends? Yeah, well, maybe Bosrog can set us up with a You seem happy. I'm glad to see that life still courses through your body. I'd be extremely out of sorts if you turned up dead. And I heard what happened. You ha Not everyone has the luxury to run off on an adventure whenever the mood takes them. I had the foreign survivors to deal with. They had to be gathered up and given shelter after the attack on our stronghold. A letter? How intriguing. What does it say? My husband plans to hold a funeral for Kurog. I suppose that makes sense. I don't think you should be here. I don't want... No, I don't want anything. Not from you. You just won't take no for an answer. Oh, all right, let me see that. A funeral? For the king? And the chief wants me to...
I'm glad you're here. Saves me the trouble of finding you. Before I return to the Somerset Isles, I want to thank you for not killing me back at the Vashrak Temple. The High Priestess was an inspiration. Her legacy will live on, in our memories and in the memories of everyone in Orsini. What's this? A funeral? And I'm invited? Splendid. That will give me a chance to say my thing. I'm going to miss this place. The temple has become a more somber place since the death of the High Priestess. The temple is going to be rededicated to Malakath now that King Kurag and the Forge Mother are gone. It's a shame, but I can't blame the... What's this? A funeral? For Kurag? I'd be honored to represent Salgra and the temple at this solemn event. Not because I have any love for the Mad King, but because I see Bob... Priestess used to study here, read her books, write her sermons. Now she's gone, and it feels like I've got a hole the size of Elden Root right in the middle. Damn right. We won, but the High Priestess died. That's awful, and it makes me so angry. It just isn't fair. But you obviously came here for another reason. Sorry I got so emotional. What? A letter? Isn't that how all this trouble started in the first place? But I guess I might as well see this through to the end, and you'll be... No sad faces. Not in here. This was Korog's happy place, and that's how it's going to stay. To Korog. To Orsinium. A funeral? No one tells me anything. I'll give you a bottle of Korog's favorite ale. I'll give you a whole damn barrel of the stuff. But only thank you. I'll have the ale. Nothing but dry bread and old turnips to eat. I never should have gotten over my heart. Hey, isn't that the King Slayer? Good work, Al.
Was ist so sie? Okay. Weird. Old friends, I'm glad to see you. This, thank you for gathering, everyone. It's a we proceed with the funeral. The ceremony is as much about Kurog. Don't worry, I'm not planning anything as audacious as Kurog. Everyone in the city has a choice to make, but it will be peaceful. Nothing will be forced upon them. No more harm. I can't forget even if I wanted to. But we need to move forward. Now please. Today tests our resolve. We have lost friends, allies, and the one responsible for all this. We've gathered to honor him. Some of you question the wisdom of that, but we need to see the awesomer in a new light. We need to respect and honor each other. That starts today. Even a good orc can fall prey to ill-conceived notions. We need to bury the past with the king and look to the future. Outsider, step forward. Your help has been invaluable, and I want you to be a part of this. Please, light the first torch. We ignite these fires to remember Kurog's true goal. Unity for the awesomer people. Instead, we have clans without chiefs. A city without a king. We will support these people. Guide them. We must look to tomorrow. Outsider. Light the second torch. It will burn away the past and guide us to the future. Remember the Gurag who was. Strong. Confident. A king who cared about his people. We will carry on that legacy. Offering help but never forcing it upon anyone, much to my regret. The clan chiefs have asked me to take on the mantle of King of the Orson. To this request, I have cautiously agreed. We cannot be seen as weak and leaderless to the rest of the world. I shall uphold Kurog's dream, but I will avoid his ambition. We shall stand together as the new Orsinium. Say your farewells, then return to the keep. We must put this darkness behind us and celebrate a new day. second I'm glad you're here. How long has it been? Will you return to Black Marsh, my friend? Sure. Or do you, you have another destination in mind? 
Thanks for the offer, but I'll go wherever I can. Your courage and resilience in the face of adversity do you honor, my friend. If not for you, the crown... <laughs> I haven't been king long enough to form an opinion. I hope the crown isn't as heavy as Kurog made it look. You have a place here with... Stay as long as you want. But as king, I declare that your service to Orsinium... I need to continue to meet with the clan chiefs and reach out to other influential orcs in the city. We have a government to forge and alliances to foster. There's a lot of work, but I... And I will. Take this. It belonged to Kurog, but you earned it. I hope I can do as much for my people as you did for Orsinium. Do my best to live up to the faith that you and the clan chiefs have seen in me. Your name will never be forgotten by the Orsoner. I must speak with you. Your name will never be forgotten by the Orsoner. We will talk of your deeds for generations. There's enough of orcs. Orcs have good. A fuck? You're supposed to be Greeting dead. Vestige. Though I can hardly call you that anymore, can I? Let us say, so you did. And I have gone on to the next great adventure. I bring you a warning, champion. Oblivion stirs. Great and a great war is coming. A war between the forces of oblivion. The be ready. Watch for signs. The war shall begin when the gates of Sothasil's lost city are reopened. So the scrolls portend, I cannot aid you in the coming battle. My time in this world is at an end. Well, that was fucking ominous as hell. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. I thought maybe the game had glitched for a second, but no, that was legit. Running speed. It's only one though. <laughs> this one see. Until next time. Goodbye, my friend. Remember how do I convert these back into gems? Um. Well met and good fortune to you. A crudely can see you are out of crates. You can always purchase more if you like. Is coming in.
Ooh. Side quests. I really don't want to be giant launched right now. I can't dive off here. Oh crap. I just wanted to look down, but I looked too far forward. Fresh. Saying they'll be here tomorrow.
Oh shit. Relic Hunter returns. Tell me. You mean, oh, King wants me. The Relic... So it really does exist. Sometimes you never know when you're dealing with myth and legend. Could I trouble you to take... So nice to have a little help around here. Indubitably, you got a talent for relic hunting, and I'd be remiss if I didn't take advantage of that. Here's a list of the relics I believe await us in the wilds of Rothgar. Find them, bring them here, and the museum will reward you handsomely. Remember to check the list. We have very specific needs here at the House of Orsum of Glories. Distinctive portions of history that you want to fill. Okay. So Filgor poisoned his own brother, and he expects the Nords to follow him. He's more foolish than he is. Freak me out.
Well, it's not going to be copyrighted, is it? Don't know how the hell I did that, but cool. So that's Nicolvara. <laughs> Small giant spiders.
trying to find the boss. There they are. Oh, there's some Oh, and they're um, a woman. They're not fucking more. Isn't my esteemed business partner? <laughs> I smell excellent. I can't wait to try it out for myself. I uh, will be rich. Uh, did you test it? How well? You're joking, right? I spent my last gold piece getting to this three forsaken wasteland. Ugh, a pox on these orcs and their stupid beasts. I suppose you've earned your cut, such as it is. I'll need to find a new opportunity now.
think maybe try and kiff it. Maybe there's like a way to land it, but not from that high. race I don't like I don't like them at all First the storm, then we crashed upon the ice. Those terrible little monsters attacked us. I just wish my wife wasn't still out there. I don't mind admitting that I'm lost without her. Help? Of course we need help. My wife is Lady Sovel, <coughs> ambassador to the High King. She was on her way to Orsinium to negotiate an important trade agreement. But the ships went off course, crashed in the storm. My wife disappeared in the confusion. You want to discuss geography? Now? My wife is missing. We need to find Lady Sovel. She was helping people off one of the wrecks, the other survivors. Captain Henriza won't risk any more sailors, but perhaps you could search the ice for me? High King Emmerich relies upon my dear Sovel. If she were here, she'd know what to do. My Lady Sovel. She was powerful. Practically a blizzard. I think it blew us off course, but uh, who am I to judge such things? I'm not a sailor and terrible with directions. Sovel says I'd get lost on my own estate if not for all the servants. Uh, I'm not sure how these negotiations work. It's really more of Sovel's area of expertise. Without her, I, I don't know who can deal with Orsinium. We did have an orc with us. Scordo. Sovel thought well of him. But you know how orcs can be. The last time I saw my wife. Right after we hit the ice. The storm was raging and everything was loud and confusing. Sovel sent me ashore with the first group of survivors. She stayed behind to help, just like she always does. Damn it. Please find her. you talking to that milksop Ethian. He's nothing like his father, nothing at all. But I don't have time for his belly aching. I need to make sure we don't lose any more people. I am. Although I'm not sure that means much now that my vessels are snapped. Off course? What do you know of navigation and seamanship? I'm paid to make port as fast and as safely as possible. I've sailed. We rescued Ethian. What more do you want? Haven't I lost enough sailors already? The ambassador's gone. Probably drowned or crushed on the ice. I have a duty to the survivors here. Besides, we never should have come to the on the quarter deck during the storm. She was helping one of those green skinned savages she loved so well. Who can say, though, I was trying to avoid an iceberg at the time.
look familiar. Which of the ships were you sailing on when... I'm the first mate of the flagship, Matir's Fortune. I... I came down here to secure the hatches when... when I saw the Ambassador's bodyguard. And then I hit... Now that you mention it, I thought something was wrong. I never sailed with Captain Henriza before, and I never sailed this part of the sea, so I could have been mistaken. I tried to reach the captain, but that's when we ran into the blizzard. I wouldn't want to disparage the captain. She works for Lord Ethian's father, and most of the ships belong to him. Because of the ambassador's mission, they wanted to make an impression. <laughs> Nobles. Can't do a riffle shuffle well, He's that's so annoying. North Point. The ambassador brought him along in case we ran into any trouble. He told me that he thought something was going on, and asked me to keep my eyes. The ambassador? I have no idea. I did see Lady Sovel and the captain having a heated dis... I'll go check on Lord Ethian. He's a nervous sort. Yeah, yeah, hold on. Damn furniture tore up my sword arm. I'm practically useless. Stupid ship started collapsing around me. Figured, sure, I enjoy being crushed under rubble as I slowly sink into icy water. What kind of question is that? I had a feeling I'd be seeing you again. You do have a habit of wandering into the most disastrous situations. Cold Harbor. I prefer to forget about that dismal place. I lost a lot of good friends there. A lot. Poor Darian. Do you remember Dar- How should I know? This may shock you, but I'm not much of a keep-in-touch person. Honestly, I picked up my rucksack and walked not long after you left. Things probably settled down, but I doubt we got all the vampires. Freaking bastards. He did, did he? Last time I saw that spineless schemer, him and Chorus the Mage were walking away. They left me under here to die. I heard them talking about the captain and the ambassador as they left. He's one of Captain Henriza's lackeys, a shifty-eyed mage who was always skulking around. Look, help me out. I don't think I can swing a sword right now, but I need to make sure the ambassador is all right. I mean, hard to believe, but not every Breton likes that High King Emmerich made peace with the orcs. They call us savages, and they want Lady Sovel's mission to fail. Captain Henriza wasn't shy about it.
much use in a fight, so I'll follow you. I suggest checking out more friends. Or maybe she headed for that tower over there. Sorry about all the coughing. How are I doing here? Did you find my dearest Sovel? Please tell me. Have you found my wife yet? Where could she be? And why did she have to stay on the ship? She cares for everyone else, but refuses to safeguard herself. Scordo, you were supposed to protect her. Impossible. The captain works for my father. She would never harm my wife. Wait, we saw the captain head toward the signal tower. That's where Sovel is. Then I have to go there too. Oh. Oh. What the hell is this? She's not here. Uh, and I think maybe that mage tried to kill me. Maybe. What? How dare you insinuate such a thing? I would never. I'm as at a loss as to where Sovel is as you are. My father promised we would go off course just long enough for Sovel to miss her meeting. We were just... It was supposed to... The captain has worked for my father for years. My father, you just can't say no to him. He said that the... I truly... Gordo found something. Oh, cool. <laughs> While you were up in the signal tower, Scordo did some scouting, and he thinks he figured out where Captain Henry is. Just down the path here, he found what looks to be an old smuggler's bolt hole in the rocks. I'll head back to camp. I need to check on the survivors. See that 
cave, that's an old smuggler's hole. Nothing really, just a gut feeling. I learned a long time ago not to ignore my gut in situations like this. Besides, I saw one of him lying. Why would you want to reason with someone like that? Do you reason with an angry Wamasu when it's trying to eat your face? No. I know you're in there, Henriza. Where's my wife? Run back to your father, you pathetic little man. Free my wife at once, you villain. I'm going to do your father a favor. She... she stabbed me! If you could untie me, I would greatly appreciate it. And would you know if my Atheon, my husband, tried to stand up to Captain Henriza? I, I never expected him to do such a thing. Ugh. Ugh. This is all Ethian's father's fault. What a vile man his father is. Ethian never could say no to him. Henriza was eager to tell me all about it after she cast. Oh. Thank you. I should go see my husband. Ethian. He wasn't. He did, didn't he? Thank you. Now, I have a job to do. I'll mourn Ethian after I. The orcs will negotiate with me. There's still time to salvage my mission and make sure Ethian's father lives to regret what he set in motion. No, my friend. You've done more than enough. The rest is up to Scordo and me. I knew Baron Matir was a despicable man, but to fall. My heart told me that. But it's good to hear you confirm it. His father... Ethian's father hoped to deal with two problems at the same time. My marriage to his son, and Emric's treaty with the orcs. But his scheme led to his own son. I need to focus first on Emric's treaty before I can allow myself the luxury of regret. I will need you to get to us in order as soon as possible. correctly will you be visiting the wrecked ships i apologize for even asking but i have no qualms admitting that i am no in light of all the lives i appreciate its appeal through the you doubt my word
speak with you a moment? I'm sure you've been looking. Did that skeever Yaus ask you to find a pen? May I speak with you a moment? Did that skeever? Oh, did he now? How typical. If that lech has a fiance, then I'm the queen of Daggerfall. That pendant is mine. It even has my initial engraved on the back. Yaus and I, we became friendly during the voyage, much to my regret. Fine, talk to the liar, but be careful. Because it belongs to me. Because he's a thief trying to make a quick profit. That pendant is mine. Tell me, my good friend. You did? That's one. Really? Why, that's ridiculous. Who would... Oh, you spoke to Azita, didn't you? Listen, she's just upset. We had a few intimate moments during the... Uh, are we start... Hmm, a gold pendant, did you say? Let me think. Yes, this one heard Yao's ask... I haven't worn shoes since I can't say that I ever noticed. She does well. Well, at least the ambassador is safe and sound. I suppose that if I can survive a raging... What a tale I'll have to tell. It's too bad about... It's a wonder any of them. Yaus talked about valuables a lot. Honestly, I never really paid him any attention. He loves the sound of his own voice. I saw you talking to Yaus. Well, I don't like to gossip, but that woman set her eye on Yaus the moment he got on board. I also understand that Azita's parents disowned her after. None of this is useful. When the withered hand came. Why didn't someone think to grab it? I don't know anything about a gold pendant, but I do know that Yao supposedly has a pretty lady in every town. Because it belongs. Because he's a thief trying to make a quick. Your belief in me is gratifying. I thought I had lost the pendant forever, and with it, my one remaining connection to my home and. I have nothing to say to you, or to that conniving witch, Azita, either. Believe me, I won't dally with another sea trollop ever again, no matter how beautiful she looks or how amazing she smells. Just a laney from now on. It, it might have actually been his. Understand. You would 
think the great artisans of Morkum are... I'm studying an eminent... What? It's an ogre den in the new... Ah, not clear. Have you met Prepare? back. Cool. Join us or die. It's that simple. Hey, fucking brutal. No, they just got chucked me. onto the fucking spear. For the others. Thanks, but I think I can do that as long as I'm right, right.
Now I know what roast horker feels like. They kept stoking the fire, making it hotter and hotter. I was... Razashaw's alive? Praise the eight and anyone else who wants to listen. Osnara, the proselytizer? She's a horror. She came by not too long ago and told them to make the fire hotter. Said it would help. You don't have to tell me twice. Anything. I beg of you, talk to us first! Don't touch the switches, will you? The Voshrock. They're trying to break us. They want Unsulag and me to swear to serve Trinimac. Or their version of Trinimac, at least. So far, they said they only need one of us. The switch in front of me releases Unsulag, but freezes me. And the one in front of her does the reverse. They keep coming in and asking us which switch to press. So far, Refuse to flip it. If I knew how to do that, I'd tell you. I hate to say this, but I don't want to die. If you free me, I can help. I'm a strong elemental mage, and I can fight. But this blasted prison keeps me from casting. Hansulog's a good woman, but she's already lived a full life. I can aid the rulers of the... Don't touch the switches! They're trapped! Trapped, you know. Touch the wrong switch and somebody dies? That kind of trapped. The Vosh Rock took us captive. Said we were gonna join their cult one way or another. If I stay in this icy prison long enough, I might just... That's the problem. If you push the switch in front of me, Gahar will be released, but I'll freeze to death. If you push the switch in front of him, I go free and he dies. They've been trying to make us decide, but we won't. Not this time. The Voshrock set this up so that only one of us would get to join their crazy cult. If I were noble, I'd say save Gahar and let me die. But I'm not noble. I have a family. Gahar seems to be a good sort. But do we really need another violent battle mage? I heal the sick and help the wounded. And more than that, I... Preserve me, thank you no. for choosing me. Oh no! I 
hate the cold. Poor Gahar. How horrible. But you made the right choice. You'll see. I feel terrible about what happened to Gahar. But I'm as good as my... Of course. My healing magic is yours to command. I... Ancient ruins full of cultists makes my knees hurt. Out of my way, youngster. I can find my own way out. <laughs> I like her. to that piece of rubbish. How does someone claim to worship a god and go on about killing someone who doesn't agree? Go ahead. We'll be right behind. No worries. We'll stay back and let you deal with any of those Bosch rock maniacs we run into.
tired. did it i don't know how i know you did your best and i'm ever so grateful we're going to stick together and find the nearest stronghold we'll hire some bodyguards and make our way Alright, I'm gonna cut the stream early. I'm feeling pretty tired, which is surprising. I'm gonna go to bed early. Just this on YouTube, please like and subscribe. If you're watching on Twitch, please consider following. If you wanna check out the Twitch stream live, and the links in the description below with the YouTube ID, or you can check me out at twitch.tv slash Windows 96. So sorry, I'm just really tired. Until next time, see you later. Bye.